we've talked a lot about this season of giving in this episode. Mm -hmm. And, you know, speaking of giving, it doesn't have to be stuff. It doesn't have to be charity. It can be giving of your time and your emotional energy to your friends. Mm -hmm. You know, and again, I think you'll experience the paradox of giving. If you just want to have a happy, fun holiday season, and the last thing you want to do is talk to a depressed person, go ahead and give them an hour. Right. And see how you feel afterwards. Yeah. Yeah. Because I'm betting the answer is going to be a little fuller than you already feel. Speaking of mental health and family members, or even Mm -hmm. friends, whoever you have over during the holidays, I saw a pretty good rule posted. Oh, really? The five-year rule. Oh. You know how when you're at a family dinner and somebody brings up shit you did when you were a kid? Oh, that's like embarrassing. That's embarrassing, Mm -hmm. humiliating, just plain wrong when you were a different, not fully developed human being yet? Oh, I've got a great story about that. Okay. Okay. So for my brother's 13th birthday, my family had a lapse in judgment and decided to have a picture of him modeling my swimsuit when he was just a little kid. So he's in this like <laughs> little <laughs> one. Oh, no. He he could he was probably like five or six in the picture. Mm-hmm. He was just little. He didn't and he, know. Yeah, well, and he was he was being funny. Mm-hmm. And everyone was oh, laughing yeah. and it was cute. But he put on my little one piece swimsuit that had little colorful fruits on it and doing like a little model pose with his hand behind his head. They went and put that picture on his 13th birthday cake. Oh, where when no. his and his friends were at the party too. And so his friends saw it. That's so mean. They unveiled That's on a whole other level than <laughs> what I was talking cruel, about. But yeah. but they unveiled the cake. He saw it and immediately burst into tears and ran to the bathroom and just spent like an hour crying on his birthday. It was so sad. I mean, but who among us hasn't put on what males among us haven't at one time or another put on a dress and Done some a lipstick? Little cross-dressing, yeah. Yeah. And yeah. looked at ourselves in the mirror and said, Would you do me? <laughs> I do me so hard. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> I actually wore some of my mom's clothes in high school. Oh, really? That might be why I got bullied. <laughs> but she had a really good understanding of a basic wardrobe, like the oh, yeah. basics. Mm-hmm. Black shirts. <clears throat> there was a nice cardigan that she had that I wore once. You couldn't oh, yeah. tell. Oh, yeah. It wasn't floral patterned or anything. No, yeah. You know, actually, one time my mom and my brother accidentally switched pants for the day <laughs> without realizing it. My mom How do you had... Not- so... Because my mom wears men's clothes. Oh, okay. You know, she like her basic outfit is a Pink Floyd t-shirt, men's jeans, jeans, and Converse. <laughs> you know? And so apparently one day she'd accidentally taken a pair of my brother's pants. Um, I don't know if he took a pair of hers, but basically all day she's like, why do these pants feel so weird? These don't feel like my usual pants. Well, finally, at the end of the day, she checks the label realizes that she's actually taken her son's pants instead of her own. <laughs> and they look normal. I I had no idea. <laughs> but I think that's kind of funny. Uh, the family that swaps pants together <laughs> stomps ants together? I don't know. I mean, yeah, probably. <laughs> <laughs> what a bonding experience. <laughs> yeah. But I think it's a good rule to, like, there's a five-year <laughs> statute of limitations or moratorium or whatever you mm-hmm. want to call it, where, yeah, if it's... If, especially if you know it's going to be an embarrassing, humiliating story. Right. And you've already brought it up every other Christmas mm-hmm. dinner. Although you'd think that the rule would be the be opposite. Off. Because the, oh, yeah. then the sting's gone by then. Right. You know? If time heals all wounds, yeah. maybe it should be only stuff that happened more than 10 years ago. Right, right. I think either or would be just fine. Because now we can bring up the whole cake in- incident with my brother and he... <laughs> He's not happy about it. Yeah. But at least he can like talk about it without it being like a tear-inducing incident, you know? 